This is a girls' hockey match at Prince Edward High School in Harare with a lot at stake. The girls here are playing in front of an American coach from Richmond University in Virginia, and if they display enough talent, a scholarship could be coming their way. This is the culmination of a five-day event that's attracted over 600 young people. They've been receiving coaching in their chosen sport from football, athletics, tennis, golf or hockey, with coaches from the USA, South Africa and Zimbabwe. Many people dream of getting a sports scholarship to a country like the United States. Colleges there have programs that offer a chance to develop sporting talent through high-level coaching. And there's also a chance at the same time to study an academic degree that will set you up for life after you hang up your boots. Well, it seems like everybody here is dreaming of a scholarship to the States. My name is Famida Patterson and I'm 18 and I'm here to play hockey. I have a really strong passion for playing hockey so I really enjoy playing it and I'm hoping to go to university and play in the university team and I know their standards they are quite high so because they take hockey more seriously there than they do here so. My name is Markham De Gunye and I'm 19 and I do 100 and 200 meters sprints. I came to try improve myself because there's coaches with you know a really high level of training and they know what they're doing. Short-term goals, I hope to go to the States, to university soon. And long-term goals, I hope to one day compete in the Olympics. This event is run by a Zimbabwean organization called Worldwide Scholarships. The director is Munya Maraere, who himself went on a scholarship to the U.S. Worldwide Scholarships is a scouting and recruiting agency that basically links African students with scholarship opportunities in the USA. We go around the region scouting different events. Over 30 people have gone over to the USA already through our program's efforts. Basically, our program is, is more centered at assisting people that have sporting and academic abilities in order to have them ease the amount that they have to pay to go to university, uh, to some of the top universities. And Dave, how can uh, a student best market themselves um, if they're in Zimbabwe, somewhere else around Africa and they hope to go to the States? Uh, obviously this setting here seems to be ideal because you're witnessing face to face, but I can also see there's video cameras here, that's another way of uh, getting in touch with the US coaches and in athletics it seems to be a question of getting a certain qualifying standard, but what's uh, What's the best way of, of marketing yourself? You know, life is about marketing yourself a little bit. And so uh, if there's a person who's listening to your broadcast and would be interested in pursuing these type of opportunities, I think the, the program here that Worldwide Scholarships has set up is, in a, is a wonderful way. Uh, you know, it's the opportunity for me to come and spend four or five days with you to watch you, you know, sometimes when you play, you have good days, you have bad days. And over the course of, of four or five days, hopefully you get a good idea as to who you are exactly.